we want to show and tell you a fish story. You know, the kind of fish story that will make anyone want to get out and fish tomorrow. We had a day this summer so magical, it will forever be burned into our memories. The morning was great. The beauty of the river was spectacular. The signs of yesterday's caddis hatch were obvious and we started picking up fish that seemingly remembered yesterday's feast. There's something about the unknown when fly fishing. You never know what you'll catch, if the bugs will hatch, if the fish will react to the hatch the way you hope. But you hope just the same. You hope they will hatch. You hope the fish will react. You hope you will witness something incredibly special. And that's what it's all about. As the day passed, a transition occurred. The light changed, the air cooled, the bugs got thick. The river seemed to slow and we started to sense the magical atmosphere with excitement. This was to be an evening we would never forget. We didn't know it yet, but we were about to witness something extraordinary. True blue, remarkable caddis magic. Gilbert and I have been testing a new method to bounce caddis on the surface of the water created by some friends, Devin Olson and Lance Egan. The idea is to allow your artificial caddis to look more lifelike by popping it on and off the water's surface, much like a natural egg-laying caddis would, all the while having a bead-headed dropper anchoring the entire system along the way. This is where it gets crazy. The thing is, this bouncing motion literally makes trout think that the fly is going to get away. When we first tried it this year, our minds were blown as we watched fish of all sizes explode through the water to take flies mid-air. We had an afternoon full of anomalies. These are not casual dry fly sippers. It was so wild to watch the fish completely lose their minds and blow out of the water in such a manner. 